friends good hello friends how are you all my name is ritika and i welcome you all in the ga session so we'll be discussing ga news for 19th and 20th of april 2021 this session will be really very very helpful for nabard grade a 2021 sebi grade a 2021 and rbi grade b 2022 so let's get started with the session you can subscribe to our youtube channel as well as join our telegram channel for the free content and the notification of our sessions in the last session friends i have given you some homework question prakash javedkar the book of prakash javedkar names the green queens of india a nation's pride shushmita mukherjee's book that is banch incomplete lives of complete women Rajiv Malhotra's book Artificial Intelligence and the Future of Power Five Battle Grounds and Sanjay Baru's book is India's Power Elite Caste Class and Culture Revolution these books are recently published in 2021 and will be very very important for your examination as you know books and authors are really very important for examination the so superstars of the session are Ayushi Maurya who have given the right answer Pankaj Dev Kashyap he have also given the right answer and Akshay Patel i request you all to please answer to the homework question below my video so that in the next session i can take up your name hello hello nilesh hello uh, hello purti ji so friends let's start with our rapid session of current affairs question number 1 we'll discuss here and i want to tell you that in the end i will be providing you a bonus slide and make you learn revise all the static ga plus the current affairs within the session so stay connected share and like the session as much as you can so recently april 2021 friends government of ghana is to acquire 100% stake in which of the following companies Option A is Airtel Ghana. Option B is Airtel Tigo. Option C is Airtel Accra. Airtel Millicom or none of the above. What is the right answer to this question? And I want you all to participate in the session. Whether you know the answer or you don't know the answer, but you have to give a guess. You can give a guess also. Guesses are also expected. uh navar grade a notification is expect expected very soon so friends yes the right answer is option number b that is airtel tigo you are correct let's discuss about this news government of ghana friends Bhar bharti in airtel and millicom international cellular sa has announced an agreement to transfer airtel tigo to government of ghana this can be an important part an important question for examination jioji will acquire 100% shares of airtel tigo along with all the customer assets and liabilities so about airtel tigo the take away for the exams are its headquarters that is in accra ghana and parent organization is bharti airtel and millicom and i can see everybody is answering so everybody whosoever have joined the session has to answer and one more thing friends i will as i promised you that i will make you learn everything within the session today we'll be having again a test on the days of march from okay on the days of march theme and days we'll learn within the session so let's move forward towards our question number 2 recently april 2021 friends the first oxygen express row row roll on roll off service departed from mumbai to which of the following places to ferry liquid oxygen for maharashtra you have to tell what is the right answer chennai goa visakhapatnam mangaluru or none of the above okay so recently first oxygen express row row has been departed from mumbai okay to which place let me know what is the right answer to this question and come on friends everybody has to participate in the session share the session as much as you can please it's my request try to come live in the session so okay i'm waiting for your answers come on friends everybody has to answer okay i'll discuss the answer the right answer is visakhapatnam friends ठीक है, the right answer is Vishakha Patnam, 
from mumbai this train express train will go to visakhapatnam to ferry liquid oxygen let us discuss about this news Fre first oxygen express friends roro roll on roll off service departed from central railway kalamboli this name is important yard in mumbai to ferry liquid oxygen for maharashtra okay from where visakhapatnam steel plant in andhra pradesh this is very important that this will take oxygen from oxygen express will take ox liquid oxygen from visakhapatnam steel plant in andhra pradesh this can be a question and the train will move by vasi road jalgaon nagpur raipur junction to visakhapatnam steel plant sliding in the east coastal railway zone and will be loaded with what liquid medical oxygen as you know oxygen is very very important covid 19 is going on so oxygen is really important so next question third question friends you have to answer recently april 2021 the ministry of tourism dekho apna desh webinar series held its 85th webinar what was the title of this webinar you have to tell me what was the title of this webinar stories of madurai vocal for local empowering local communities gujarat bhundi architectural heritage of a forgotten rajput capital or khajurao temples the architectural splendor or none of the above what is the right answer to this question come on okay nilesh is giving the answer okay everybody rest everybody is requested to give the answer for this question okay parul is also giving the answer and the right answer for this question is friends khajuraho temple of architectural splendor was the title for 85th webinar let us discuss this news Union Ministry of Tourism Dekho Apna Desh webinar series held its 85th webinar okay and the title of this 85th webinar was Khajuraho Temples of Architectural Splendor on 17th of April 2021 Dekho Apna Desh webinar series is an effort to showcase India's richest diversities under Ek Bharat Shreshtha Bharat Kajurao is a village in Chhatrapur district of Madhya Pradesh India and friends let me know the national parks of Madhya Pradesh do you know Le give the answer for this question which all national parks are there in Madhya Pradesh okay unesco uh, declared temples of kajurao as the world heritage site and kajurao temples were built in 1950 1050 ad by the chandela dynasty so i'll tell you the right answer the national parks of madhya pradesh are bandhav madhav panna pench satpura van bihar fossil and kuno we will learn all the national parks as well in the bonus slides i will provide you all the national parks as well as wildlife sanctuary as well as all the important data which is asked in the static gk part of your examination okay so let's move forward towards our next next question friends question number 4 recently april 2021 supplemental oxygen delivery system for soldier posted at extreme high altitude areas have been developed by which of the following labs of drdo now you have to tell me the name of the lab it has been developed by drdo done but we have to tell the name of the lab defense bioengineering and electromedical laboratory devil advanced system laboratory asl defense electronics art application laboratory deal defense electronic research laboratory dlrl or none of the above what is the right answer to this question okay so everybody is giving the right answer everybody is saying option number a is right so let us discuss what is the right answer to this question and the right answer is option number a you all are correct friends defense bioengineering and electromedical laboratory dbel is the right answer let us discuss this news in deep 
डिफेंस रिसर्च एंड डेवलपमेंट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन फ्रेंड्स डीआरडीओ हैज डेवलप्ड सप्लीमेंटल ऑक्सीजन डिलीवरी सिस्टम फॉर होम फॉर सोल्जर्स पोस्टेड एट एक्सट्रीम हाई एल्टीट्यूड एरिया as you all must be knowing that high altitude area in the high altitude area the level of oxygen is less okay the level of oxygen is less at the high altitude areas it is developed by defense bioengineering and electromedical laboratory dibel bangalore of drdo this labs name is very very important so please 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 learn this this will be important question for examination the system delivers what supplemental oxygen based theek hai for the to prevent person from hypoxia now the question is what is this hypoxia why this supplemental oxygen delivery system has been developed to save the people from hypoxia to save the soldiers from hypoxia now hypoxia is a state in which friends amount of oxygen reaching the tissue is inadequate as you know oxygen is very very important okay oxygen is important when we take in oxygen the food break downs when the food break down then energy is produced and energy is very very important to do all the work okay you know this so hypoxia is a state in which oxygen reaching the tissue is inadequate is less so energy requirement of the body is not fulfilled is it clear so to prevent this the supplementary oxygen delivery system has been developed pro by drdo's defense bioengineering and electromedical laboratory debel so this is the case this hypoxia case is the same case which happens to the covid patient friends the level of oxygen reaching the tissue is in inadequate so this will be helpful for them also so take away for the exam about drdo headquarters are new delhi and the chairman is dr g shatish reddy i think this part is clear So let's move forward to words. Our next question, that is question number five. Recently, friends, April twenty twenty one, India has signed an agreement on cities combating plastic entering the marine environment with which of the following countries? So an agreement has been signed. You have to tell this agreement has been signed with which of the following countries. whether it is france japan germany usa or none of the above what will be the right answer to this question and try to come live share the session as much as you can i promise you all i assure you all that if you are connected in my session i'll make you learn everything which is important for the examination by linking all the news as i'll show you here only i will link each and every news and make you learn all the ga within the session Okay, very good. Nilesh has given the right answer, and uh, okay, the right answer for this question is friends. Option number C, that is Germany. Related to France, we know one MOU has been signed between India and France. If you remember, for the Gaganyaan, India will send its astronauts to space in the Gaganyaan on the seventy-fifth Independence. of india that is in 2022 and france space agency will be helping india in this mission if you remember i have told you in the last session japan friends recently you know that the water the destroyed water is being released to sea and ocean by fukushima nuclear power plant and this fukushima nuclear power plant is in japan japan is planning to do this you all know and china and south korea are saying that no this deal this agreement should not take place as this destroyed water will be very harmful for humans as well as for the aquatic animals and the right answer to this question is germany like this keep connecting and linking all the news so that everything is there in your mind done let's move forward friends explanation union ministry of housing urban affairs government of india giz india on the behalf of german federation ministry of environment nature Con conservation and nuclear uh, safety signed an agreement on technical cooperation titled as cities combating plastic entering the marine environment in new delhi so basic aim for this was that we have to prevent plastic entering the marine environment if plastic will enter the marine environment obviously it will be very very destructing it will be very destructing 
the aquatic life will be disturbed it will be uh, very much harmful for humans also so to prevent this plastic entering in the marine environment this agreement has been signed between india and germany done i hope this news is clear and state of uttar pradesh kerala andaman nicobar islands and cities of kanpur kochi port blair and the, all will be participating in this for a period of 3 and a half years i hope this news is also clear to you if you are liking the session to hit the like button so question number 6 friends all the questions which i am discussing in the session with you are really very very helpful for your examination point number 1 the data which i am providing you in the bonus slide is also very very helpful for your examination point number 3 will be revising we will connecting all the news and learn everything within the session okay recently april 2021 india's naval air squadron 323 inas 323 navy's first unit of indigenous built advanced light helicopter alh mk3 this helicopter was commissioned at which of the following places option number a is ins kadamba kanwar ins dwarka okha ins hansa goa ins sardar patel porbandar or none of the above let me know what is the right answer very good nilesh is uh, giving the answers correct answers please else everybody is also requested to keep giving the right answer keep answering in the session keep participating in the session okay friends so the right answer to this question is ins hansa goa okay so this is the right answer let us discuss the news indian naval air squadron 323 ins 323 navy's first unit of indigenous built advanced light helicopter mk3 was commissioned at INS Hansa Goa this is important okay the squadron will operate three state of art ALH M3 a multi role helicopter with a shakti engine friends basically what is the work of this helicopter is to search rescue special operation and the coastal surveillance okay and this was manufactured by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited HAL you have to learn this also the question can be asked on this also let's move forward to our question number 7 recently april 2021 which of the following indian short films got minted as a non fungible token nft non fungible total uh, token nft for those that watch me dream duri goodbye love best man or none of the above what is the right answer to this question come on friends let me know what is the right answer which film has been minted in the nft exactly correct correct nilesh very very nice the option number a is the right answer for those that watch me dream is the right answer for this question friends so let us discuss this news the short film titled titled as for those that watch my me dream by terence harry fernandes okay remember his name also he was the director of this movie short film has been minted on the blockchain with a base price of 0.3 ethereum that is 674.53 dollars production house lay hack has announced that it has been listed the world's first indian short film as an nft on open sea biggest marketplace of nft so remember the name of this movie this short film it can be asked in your question let's move forward towards our next question recently friends april 2021 mastercard has bought which of the following digital id verification firm in a deal of 8850 million dollars poly outreach white pages ekta or none of the above what is the right answer to this question let me know what is the right answer to this question friends mastercard has bought which of the following digital id verification firm in a deal of 850 million dollars very good abhijit that's great 
and the right answer is option number d that is ekta friends option number d is the right answer to this question mastercard has agreed to buy digital identification verification company ekta in a deal of 850 million dollars as a global payment processor for base the digital security space now let us discuss two three points about ekta ekta products what do ekta product do they allow businesses to separate fraudster from legitimate customer during the digital interaction like opening an online account or making any digital payment it operates in three industries these three industries are friends e-commerce payments and financial services headquarters are greater seattle area west coast and western usa and the chief executive officer is rob elwitt so you have to remember all these things all these points related this news next question number 9 is recently april 2021 friends green corridors has been set up for vehicles with red stickers in which of the following cities it is very easy question and i want to know whosoever will give the right answer to this question friends recently green corridors has been set up for vehicles with red stickers in which of the following cities with jaipur new delhi bangalore mumbai or none of the above nilesh has again given the right answer very nice and option number d mumbai is the right answer to this question friends mumbai police have created a green corridor for all the uh, all the vehicles all these vehicles like belonging to doctors medical staff ambulance medical equipment and testing kits they have provided them with a red sticker and they their speedy movement of these vehicles are being allowed okay and the transporting food vegetable fruits groceries and dairy product will be given green stickers so i hope this is very easy news and this is clear to you so let's move forward towards our question number 10 recently friends april 2021 which of the following companies completed its 75 years of construction mining machinery business let me know the right name ircon international limited gmr infrastructure limited larsen and turbo I, irb infrastructure developer limited and none of the above what is the right answer to this question come on and friends i request you all to please join live try to come live in the session let's make this session interactive let's ask questions from each other let's revise everything let's learn all the ga within the session for this you have to join live with me in the session and the right answer to this question is friends option number C that is Larson and Turbo. Let us discuss about this news. Larson and Turbo L&T has supplied over sixty thousand units of various equipments in the country during seventy-five years association with construction and mining industry. So L&T has completed seventy-five years of its business. These machines have been used to create landmarks of exceptional designs. significantly contributed to the growing infrastructure of the nation and friends important thing the important take away headquarters of lnt are in mumbai founders are henning hawk larsen and soren christian turbo and the ceo of this company is sn subramanian so we have to learn all these things also question can be asked on this also so the next is the bonus slide friends in the bonus slide i am giving you something you have to learn that and i'll be taking a test on the days also i have planned something friends first i will take test on 1st to 10th of march then i'll be taking your test of days and themes which i have provided in the first session of 11th to 20th march and then the test will be there for the days and themes for 21st to 30th 31st march This is how we will learn and revise all the days and themes of March within the session. First bonus slide you will getting banks, their headquarters and key people. This is important. Bank of Baroda headquarters are in Vadodara, Gujarat. Key people. Its chairman name is Hasmuk Adia and its MD and CEO is Rajiv Chadda. Punjab National Bank's headquarter is in friends New Delhi. Okay and MD and CEO name is SS Malika Arjun Rao 
State Bank of India SBI's headquarters are in Mumbai and Dinesh Kumar Khara you have to remember Bank of India Mumbai MDN CEO is Atanu Kumar Das Yuko Bank its headquarters are in Kolkata and Atul Kumar Goyal is the MD and CEO of Yuko Bank you have to learn all this i'll be asking you in the next session now it's time for test okay we'll be revising you will be giving test for te first to 10th of march all the days and themes i'll going to ask you so that we are able to learn everything within the session so first is first march which day is observed on first march and what is the theme for the day for 2021 this you have to tell me come on everybody has to participate in the test basically i'm taking this test or i'm giving you the bonus slide the reason is i want you to learn everything within the session so for this you have to participate in the test let me know first of march which day has been observed and what is the theme for 2021 for that day come on very good nilesh is giving the right answer no nilesh think about it so friends okay first of march two days are observed that is zero discrimination day and civil accounts day and the theme for zero discrimination day is end inequalities please try to learn this please please learn days and themes are really really very important third of march okay the next date is third march which day is observed on third march and what is the theme for 2021 come on friends answer which day has been observed on 3rd of march and theme for 2021 is what so let me tell you world wildlife day has been observed on 3rd march and the theme for 2021 is forest and livelihood sustaining people and planets and world herring day is also observed on 3rd march you have to learn this and theme for 2021 is herring care for all screen rehabilitate and communicate next question 4th of march if you remember let me know which day is observed on 4th of march and what was the theme for 2021 come on can try to learn all the days and themes and whatever i give you in the bonus slide within the session so that your time at the home is utilized less in learning all these things and within the session we learn everything so 4th march is the national safety day and friends national security day is also observed on 4th march sarak suraksha road safety was a theme for national safety day 2021 Next is 8th of March International Women's Day is observed on 8th March and the theme was women in leadership achieving an equal future in the covid-19 world this was the theme for International Women's Day 10th of March 10th of March friends the Central Industrial Security Forces CSIF raising day is observed on 10th March so these were the days from 1st to 10th March now tomorrow uh, in the next session i'll be taking the test of the days from 11th to 20th of march please learn the days as well as their three themes and get ready for the test the homework question is you have to tell me the national parks of madhya pradesh assam west bengal kerala and tamil nadu and you have to answer this below my video in the comment section and friends thank you so much thanks for watching the session and please try to come live thank you so much bye bye take care catch me live at 1 pm on friday on editor bye bye take care